Hey guys, here's your presentation for Friday, December 11th. Go ahead and fill out the attendance link so you can get credit for being here, even though you missed the live session. All right, so a couple of reminders. That Protus vocab we've been telling you about, it's coming up. It's due on Monday. Okay, so make sure you get that done and make sure you're also studying for your Protus quiz, which will also be on Monday. Make sure you understand the four different Protus and their basic functions of life because that is what you will be quizzed on. Um, today we're gonna be doing a Protus Wanted poster. It will be graded, um, so I'm gonna go ahead and explain to you how to do that activity. So the instructions are here for you. It says create a Wanted poster that's gonna incorporate an amoeba, a paramecium, a euglena, and Volvox. So back in the day, whenever there was a criminal and they didn't really have technology to get information out, they would print like posters or have like wanted posters and the criminal's face would be on the front of it. And they would put all kinds of information on that poster as to like where you could find the person or any type of information that would help you find the person. So we're creating a wanted poster for our four protists. So on the front of your poster, it should have the words wanted and then a labeled picture of the four protists. So you gotta make sure you find pictures of each of the protists that have the different parts of their um, organelles labeled, all right? And then you'll put a reward on the front of your poster. Your reward can be a piece of gum. It can be your little sister. It can be $10,000, whatever you want it to be, as long as it's appropriate, okay? All right, and so the back of your poster is gonna be all the pertinent information about your four different protists. You're gonna tell me how it gets its food or energy, how it moves around, how it reproduces, and where it's found, okay? And then you're gonna pick any two organelles within the protist, list it, and tell me what it does for the protist, like what's its role. So here you'll see your rubric and what points you will get for specific things. On the front, your labeled picture for each of the four protists will earn you five points each. The amoeba, you have to have the four facts, like right here, how it gets food, moves, reproduces, and where it's found. Those are the four facts it's referring to. Each fact is worth four points apiece for a grand total of 16. And then the two organelles with the description of what they do for the amoeba, um, each one of those is worth two points for a grand total of four. The same breakdown for paramecium, euglena, and vulvox um, occur, and it adds up to a grand total of 100. So here is an example of front versus back. Um, you'll have wanted at the top. You'll have your four protists labeled. Um, these were not labeled pictures. I didn't want to put labeled pictures on the example because I didn't want you guys to steal my pictures. So make sure yours are labeled, okay? And then your reward at the bottom. On the back, I would just separate it into fours and list my information under each different protist, how it gets its food, how it moves, how it reproduces, where it lives, and the two organelles and their role within that specific protist, okay? So you guys will have um, a blank slate that kind of looks like this if you guys just wanna like input the information or if you wanna completely format your poster the way you wanna do it, that's cool too. Um, if you'd actually rather literally make a poster or do it on computer paper, handwritten and colored and drawn, that's perfectly fine too. Just make sure you take a picture of it and you upload it because it is for a grade, okay? So we are grading this, so you gotta make sure that you incorporate every single thing that you see here on your rubric, okay? If you have any questions specifically about the assignment, make sure you let your teacher know so that we can help you. Thanks.